Dollar Thrifty Automotive Group says it would rather drive alone. After seeking a buyer for more than a year, Dollar Thrifty rejected all the offers and says it plans to stay an independent company. And it's going to move ahead with its plan to buy back $400 million in stock. Last month, Dollar Thrifty wrote to Hertz and Avis, setting a deadline of yesterday for their best and final offers. Avis then dropped out of the bidding process, leaving Hertz as the only company with an offer on the table in May. Hertz was offering about $2.2 billion, Avis about $1.7 billion. Dollar Thrifty CEO Scott Thompson says the company didn't receive an offer that it considered acceptable, so it will continue on a standalone basis. Now, Thompson says Hertz is still interested in buying Dollar Thrifty, but he says the offer from Hertz did not adequately meet antitrust concerns. Dollar Thrifty says it still expects its third quarter rental car revenue to increase by about 2% from the same time last year. Dollar Thrifty, by the way, is down about 4% in early trading, but it's up 28% so far this year. From the floor of the NASDAQ, I'm Carter Evans for CNN Money.